Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm the Marmoset, and much to my dinging disappointment, these guys are back. Grrr. Um, we will just flat out retreat from this fight, and we will all, you know, just fly away. Um, I didn't really want that moon leaf though. Um, what are you? That's influence. Your gold. What can we get over there? Probably if we fly around these assholes. Just bugger off. I mean, if you're heading towards one of my cities, please do so. But just hurry up and make your mind. Maybe go over here. So, we have failed to achieve the market alchemist. At least one of the first. So, someone else has got that adamantium, that uh, nectar of Asia. We have a request to boost our wine. Yes, I want the happiness. And you've built me a garth. And now working on a settler. You've grown that a little bit more, so we're just that a little bit stronger. Six turns till winter, which means we get a significant advantage, because we can move and no one else can. Two turns to a settler, we'll have a monk in five turns. Could spit out that fish farm now, but I'm not that interested in it. Glory of the Empire costs 350, Central Market 350. Our happiness is fine at the moment. You were coming down to here. Because we can. If we get a fight picked, we will run away, but these people are mostly pacified now. What do you want? You're a roaming army. Oh, those are the scythers. That's fun. Um, you lot. Get over to the capital. <laughs> and you guys come down to the capital. Alright, this could be interesting. Um, let's bring in a little bit more reinforcement temporarily. It's in there. Bit of resource. It's a wine extractor. Alright, well, we'll have plenty of wine. I suppose we might as well have you hovering over it anyway. Because then at least when the city becomes under siege, we can get a boost from it. Alright. Yep, you just wait there. We'll end that turn. So where are you going? Just north, apparently. And then you are pitching up. You are going to utterly ruin my army if I try and hold it. You are seriously dangerous. So I am going to suggest that we retreat. You are going to take a pounding. You are going to be fine because you are inside the city. You try down to... not that one unit. Go over there. You guys... Well, if they attack the city, they attack the city. There's not much more I can do about it. We might as well have you guys in the city. Because then you can pick up the unit and escort him somewhere useful. Shooting intensifier is done in Avara, so we've now got double resources on the titanium, so that will tick in quite nicely. You're that unit, you are heading down to Nodoran. I'm going to assign you in three turns. So yeah, just hold your ground there. Happy with you being there. If you attack, we do have plenty of units, and we've got the defensive bonus from the city, because we're inside it. End of the turn. Hey! So, we've got 30 titanium, we got... Alright, so if we'd actually fitted them, we'd have got 150 dust, we don't necessarily need the dust. It's so important that the opponents protect it with their blood sir. This is servants. Chapter 6. Nemesis disturb our works. Here is the threat. Cannot fail. Face Nemesis in a way of trying to choose him. The Prince Nemesis shows that we must build Terra of Truth or Fidelity and a Ward of Auriga in every single one of our cities. Alright. So we were building some Skyfins. That's cancelled.
Um, so we need to build Towers of Truth in every single one of our cities. Uh, you've apparently got watchtowers queued up. Tower of Truth, we have it nearby. Make that a priority, please. And I'm tired of you trying to grow, build instead, because I want that in four turns. I think we needed to get was okay, lenses, expansion, shapeshifters. Uh, where is it? City improvements, Wall Gavariga. So we can afford to unlock that. But they do cost 30 pearls, so we're gonna have to wait till winter. We can get that in the interim. So you're building. An Abbey of Anomalies in four turns, or a Tower of Truth in two, please. I would also like a Tower of Truth here. Stick it there. And stick it on the border so we can just see it a little bit more. Please build a Tower of Truth in a turn. Thank you very much. Please also build the Tower of Truth in a turn. Thank you very much. And then we will need to be saving up 90 pearls to get everyone we want. So I think what we will be looking at doing... Is that adamantium? Is that adamantium? That's adamantium. Um, I don't want that quest. I want the sad ones. No, that is my quest. So we need 90 pearls. So it looks like we will be holding off on that settler, because that would mean we need 120 pearls. So we're actually 12 turns away from finishing everything in this list, so I can queue up one, two, three, two, three, another army here. And we'll build them in time. Bread and Circus is kicking in a turn, making sure we're going to be even happier. Cannot unassign you for another turn. Alright, so we're still technically at war. The scythers have gone. You can now return back over to what I would call the front. I am being followed by these increasingly annoying barbarians. And I can activate that, yes. Nice big science boost. We'll just keep this guy just bimbling back and forwards if we need him. Alright, you stay there. You join the city. Have the hero just unassigned. And good, you're going to be heading for heading that way. Uh, yep, yep, okay, fine. Done. Bread and Circus is done. Good to pull. We're getting up the smelting section next. Which allows us to put production units on these. We've built a fish farm. A Tower of Truth, another Tower of Truth. Used. You didn't build, didn't be, didn't indeed build your Tower of Truth. That's it there. Win? Did I ask you? Pretty sure I did ask you to build Browse. No, there is a Tower of Truth. I don't want to destroy it, I just don't know where it is. Well, that's it. Fine. Alright, so we have a Tower of Truth in there. Our armor has grown. Nice to see. Don't think we necessarily need everyone doing on that. Let's get some production out. With that in mind, I can ask you to queue up a couple of the monks. And then pop two off there. So 21 turns for a full army. If I ask you for another monk, that's 16 turns. You build the seekers, you build the monks. So we'll have another full army in 18 turns. Uh, actually, one less than that, because we've already got at, no, you're the monk for this army. So I'm happy with that. So you pitch up there. You. And I. Sign a hero yet? No, one more turn. Alright, we'll just, wherever she's ended up, we'll leave her be. You hold that ground. 
That will do me. Have you... Yeah, you're still wandering around being a pain in the ass. And you've not healed yet. Um... I wouldn't mind some of that material. Go do that in a bit. Okay, production up. Tower of Truth has been built, now on the right. So we've got all the Towers of Truth, now we just need the anomalies, which means we need winter. Fortunately, that's only a couple turns away. You went to the bother of declaring war on me. You are careful. Because you stole our pearls. Would you like a truce? No. Fine. I'm kind of tempted to burn you off the face of the earth, but I need two armies to do that. They're busy now with the time of our winter of pearl hunting. Alright. Unwanted item strategic resource cost on Empire. Smelting station done. Winter has ha happened. Minus 30% attack on units. Okay. So we need 100 adamantium. We will get 60 Mithrite if we complete it, a load of cuss, and we'll cancel the Unwanted Oxidation quest. Alright, so that looks like something we will be having a look at doing. Um, but to do it, we need Adamantium, of which we have a strategic resource thing already on top of, so we're building some of that over there. So we're currently generating two from Army. So, Strategic Intensifier. Yes, I would like that a little sooner. Can't point in building next, we've already got it. Palladium, yes. Adamantium, yes. Adamantium, yes. Nothing else really I need in that lot. Yeah, just stick it on the end, I don't need it that soon. Well, actually. Let's spend it and get it immediately. Can't get on because I've had to finish it off. The ice works. Yes, I wouldn't mind the extra production. Can build the winter burrow. That's going to have to wait until after we've got dealt with this. So you grab that and that. And then grab that one. You, my friend, head there. And then grab that one. Now, I believe you have Origa Affinity. So we get more pearls, so we should probably also get you pearl hunting. But we are at war. Essentially, we'd have to buy their truce, and I just don't have the patience to do that. So over there we're going to get 9 pearls plus 30 percent, yes. Uh, dust water cannot reactivate, that's fine. Skyfin's leveled up. Production has produced a monk for us. We'd like to make you a new army. And try and catch up with this guy. Idea quite why people want me to go there, but you now this guy head north and just, you know, just start picking up pearls. I need pearls, more pearls, more pearls, more pearls, always more pearls. You're out of move. You're out of. You're not out of move, so you can grab that one for me. And then we're also going to head probably to there and grab that one. Alright, then you are. The monk unit. You managed to go past that at some point. Uh, you've got some move left, but I want you to catch up with the monk. Alright, 30 pearls. Maybe means we can build the ward of Auriga. Can't rush it, but it's only two turns. So get that done as soon as possible. So, a lot of the LIA's work is pearl hunting, so Dredge you've leveled up. We should be now be able to assign you back to this city. Take the boost from that. 
the Water Reed will happen next turn. So you've got your bits and pieces next to the Dolly, so our Adamantine level up rate should be now be up to three. Grab that one. One with Auriga. You've got Auriga Affinity 2, which is good. Grab that pearl. Meet up. Become an army of six. Then head to there. You've still got plenty of movement left. Don't know where those um, angry people whose uh, population are desecrated ended up with, so be it. I would like you to head just up this way. Head for that pearl. That's fine, just take the beach that way. Now we will do this. Nope, and the turn. Reaping station. Nice. Uh, Blood Crystal Extractor, we've already got one, but we'll have another one. You don't get anything else. You've not got anything else. It's fine by me. You are slowly struggling for food. Can I afford to buy you a fish farm? Yes, I can. And then I need to head to this place. And make sure we are breaking even cash wise. So we've got these guys have turned up and have laid siege to one of our cities. So I know where unfortunately you are going right now. Not much I can really do to help with that. Our militia are not going to be able to cope. I'm assuming with only a minus eight, it'll take them a while. Thank you for that. So we built Benevolent Emperor in Banana, so our cash flow is doubling from there. You in the interim are going to have to jump onto the pearl grabbing beauties over here. And do so. So yes, pick that up. And then head to there. So that much we can do about that. We'll have to wait and see. Army wise, yes, you've still got some move left, so grab that. I don't think you can make it to there, but we'll move towards it anyway. Alright, so you being there is a bit of a pain in the ass. We've apparently not decided to attack. So we will bring this unit up to there. Might as well grab the pearls as we pass. Yes, I know. That's why I'm here, ready to fight. That's nice and close. Um, we can't actually spread out any closer to get a better attack for Tatan, so I will launch that. Um, yeah, you guys attack that one, everyone else attack that one. Launch. We should be able to get behind them, do a fair bit of damage. Alright, took no damage, so our armor's holding them there. I think it's our four or Skyfin, it's just the one of them, just not capable. Whereas this guy... It's winter, so he's just that more, much more deadly. And they're going last, I think I would expect them to be deceased before the end of this round. Let's just quickly check on my hero and see what kind of weapon he's using. I don't necessarily, I mean, it looks like he's got a sparkly shield. Yes, thank you very much. And we've got some grass silk for our trouble. Plus 100% trade routes. Well, we might as well just activate that now. Also activate that. Let's move some that, let's spit that one out as well. Now we're making a lot of money. No idea where from, I suspect it's probably because this booster has kicked in. So we'll, leave, we'll just move those guys off. We can build a winter borough, but as we said we were holding off on that. So you now have points and movement, so you can come up to here. You've got movement, so pick that up. And then that one. You have to dodge them, which is fine. 
I'm at war with you, so I don't think I can bimble around your territory and grab some of your pearls, but there are more pearls up here that interest me more. Can't quite get to that one that quickly. There's more pearls up this way that interest me more. Hmm, actually, while we're here. Hello, Ruin. Occasionally you have pearls on you. You do. Two of them, in fact. They just go to there. And we built a fish farm in Noloran and the Abbey of Anomalies in Noloran. So, you should be not starving, which is good to see. A few more pearls, and we get our next one of those. Then we can actually send the city out once we've got this complete. Create a new table of worries. Return to the ruins and expect them for Titan Bones. Ooh, production. Yeah, we'll hopefully get round to that. Let's, uh... Oh, Rust to Ruins the Cooperative Quest. Relocation of the Blind. Let's pin that one. Don't worry about that in a sec. Yes. What do we do to keep our people happy? We keep them drunk. Very drunk. Glory of the Empire from there. So another monk. So, that's the eyeless ones. And that's you, so pick that up. Yeah, there's that roaming army. You've apparently been seriously battered by various people at some point. You're down to 58, but you do so much damage. Um, hmm. Hmm. No, pearls. Focus on the quest. There's another 30. So we will head to Avaram. Pick up our ward. Top of the queue. Yeah, we'll get it grow as quickly as we can. you still got a few more movement points, so head up to here. You're there. Go. Right, so we lose everything when we just board, so we might as well just do it, and then turn to head to there. Thank you. So, Ruins and Spectrum is that one. The other one we have a competitive quest for. It's from Rust to Ruin. There's one of them. There's another one. There's one. Oh, they're right next to each other. And there's one. Alright. So we just need to pick one of these, stand next to it, and every now and then just dump adamantium onto it. So you've got plenty of move, come down to here. And then there. And we'll worry about these side quests once we've got our pearls. Which we now have ten, so accumulating at a suitable rate. Uh, yeah, we will come out to that one, head to see. And that's that episode. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. It's become a pearl rush, because that's what we need. In fact, it's delaying our growth, which is a little bit annoying. We've got plenty of happiness from other bits and pieces, but here we go. I'm the Marmoset. This has been Endless Legends. It's winter, and the LIA are black and happy about this. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.